Hey everybody, Big Black Hat Man here. And hey everybody, it's Dusty. I am back. I am here to get show you all my new. Whoa. What are you doing? I am threatening to shoot you in the head. Why? I'm the friendliest guy on TV. Do you not recall the last time you were here and you stole my hat? Um, I, I wasn't really trying to steal your hat. I was, uh, yeah. I was, I was admiring your hat. It's, yeah. it's, 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 it's a, it's a nice hat. I'm not here to get enough excuse not to shoot you in the head. I was borrowing it for a prop for my next show. Try again. You're not going to shoot me. Why not? Well, because... You don't really have the budget for the special effects to shoot me. True. And besides, you'd lose your PG rating. True. So can we just go on? Dusty, I'm going to regret asking you this. Why are you here? Well, I'm so glad you asked. I have been offered my own show. Oh, God. TLC wants me to host Dusty's Mythical Creatures. TLC has offered you a show. Yes. Why wouldn't they? I am charismatic. I am brilliantly hilarious. Plus, I am super knowledgeable about mythical creatures. They want me to host my own show. Twelve so, episodes a year. That doesn't explain why you're here. I humbly need your help. Oh, that's a riot. You need my help. Well, as amazing and um, surprising as this may sound, you are the best cameraman I know. I need you to go with me on my next adventure, film it in a very professional manner, oh, no. so I can get a bigger budget from TLC for my show. I think I'm going to shoot you anyway. What's in it for me? A full-time gig with me being my cameraman? Traveling to exotic places to find mythical creatures. But I've got to be with you. Uh, I'll let you stay in a separate hotel room. Believe me, I will promise you a separate hotel room. You know, that was an option at this point. Uh, uh, Free meals on the road at places other than McDonald's. And if we play our cards right, we could get sponsorships from places like Cabela's. Okay, okay, wait, hold on. I will do this. But, thanks. I but, 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 you must help me get my own show as well. What exactly would you do with the show? Don't worry okay, about okay, it. Okay, 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 that's fine, that's fine. I will, I will use my connections in the entertainment industry to help you get your own show. If you okay. will just help me film will, this episode. All right, I will help you. Awesome. That, that'll be great. All right. All right. Well, let's... Do, do we need to shake on it, sign a contract, anything like that? I won't shoot you. We'll call that good. All right. I can live with that. All right. All right we better get started. All right. Hi, everybody. Dusty here. And today we're going to go on a new adventure. I was thinking about heading to the Arctic, but it's really not quite the season yet for those Arctic animals. So we're going to stay here in North America. I'm not sure exactly what creatures we're going to find yet. But we're going to search for them, and you will know it when we find them, because mythical creatures are real. <laughs> Whoa, Big Black Hat Man, I proved that to you last time proof, we were proof, searching. Proof, I don't call running around blindly proof. Go back, watch our first episode. It's some western thought thing with mythical creatures, and it's under Big Black Hat Man. I mean, it, it was his show. Yeah. Anyway, well, go find show, it. And then some you'll see, you'll see, it. You'll see the proof, and... Today we're going to find more proof, we're going to find more creatures, it's going to be exciting, it's going to be fun, and you might learn something along the way too. I, how are they going to learn anything from a crazy person? How could they possibly learn when anything from a crazy person? When we have film proof of mythical creatures, they really don't become mythical once there's film proof. But anyway, when we have the film <sighs> proof, they're going to learn something and, you know, 
they're going to be part of this wonderful discovery. It's 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 going to be great. I'm suddenly Come feeling, on. I'm suddenly feeling extremely guilty about what I'm heaping upon the world. There's no guilt here. It, no, there's tons of guilt. Trust me. I am enlightening, entertaining, and teaching. Fattening. Is teaching kind of the same as enlightening? Um, pedagogical, probably. What? 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 Ped Never mind. Don't don't worry about that word. Anyway, uh, it's going to be great. Come along with us and just see all the fun that there is in nature. What the hell are you doing? Shh. I'm blending in with the environment so the creatures come to me. You realize you have on an orange shirt. A bright orange shirt. Creatures are colorblind. Everybody knows that. Uh, uh, never mind then. Okay. Besides, I've been shot at a few times. This is a safety factor. You've been shot at a... I, I can see the, why somebody might do that. I think they mistook me for some kind of animal. I think they mistook you for you. Anyway. Sometimes you have to let the creatures come to you. Okay. You realize we're in my backyard and there's no creatures back here, right? They are everywhere. They're I ev told you this. You just aren't looking for them. Uh, you have to know what you're looking for. What am I looking for? Nature. Uh, Nature. You don't, you don't tear up my lawn. That's my lawn. Don't tear that up. Looks like you need some fertilizer. But well, anyway. I probably do. It's if, probably that if, time. If you but... weren't having all this banter, they might be coming to us right now. <sighs> What are you, Dusty, we're still in the yard. Du we haven't left the yard, Dusty. What are you looking for? Quiet, 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 quiet. That's my tree. Be it careful. Could be in the tree. There's nothing in that tree. It's just a tree. It's, it's, it's a tree planted there by, well, not by me, but somebody who lived here you before see the me. Leaves? They yeah. use those as camouflage. Oh, God. They could be in there. I'm so ashamed of myself right now. I'm incredibly ashamed of myself. Well. It's a, I'm not seeing any real signs of a mythical creature in this tree right now. That's because it's just a tree. But it's just, there's nothing. You can look over this whole backyard. There's nothing here that I would. I did not bring my climbing gear, so today we can't go up in that tree. The the top of the tree is only that high. Some there other is day, nothing in that tree. We might go in the giant redwoods of California and see the mythical creatures that live in the top of the redwoods. What the, what mythical creatures live in the top of the redwoods? No one knows because they're so tall. Oh, people have been to the top of the redwoods. There, there's a whole thing in about National Geographic and the. Climbing the redwoods. Those are tricks of Hollywood. Oh, no one's God. actually climbed those trees before. There's yeah. a whole culture that lives in the top of those trees. This that's, is brutal. That's, 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 that's oh, episode. this is brutal. Just follow along. All follow right, along. I'm following along. I can't believe. You can clearly see we're in a residential neighborhood. This is, that's that's my garden, yes. That'd be cedar mulch. Don't, don't touch my cedar mulch. Don't, what are you doing? What are you doing? If you had some water in this watering trough, it's not you a water, more, it's a bird bath. You would have more creatures coming to your backyard. Ah. They, they need to drink. It's just a bird bath. It doesn't really matter. There's a water rain barrel right over there. They can drink out of that. What are you doing? I, oh, this, these modern things. There would be... The sidewalk? Are you there, talking about the sidewalk? There would be tracks along here because this is a natural path. It's, it's not a natural path, it's an unnatural path, it's a sidewalk. There it was put in by a human if being. There, if there wasn't you concrete are, here, there would be tracks. Oh, the insanity. You can see the patio and my grill, and this is clearly my backyard. I don't know what you're looking for in my backyard. Have you been using that grill to feed these mythical creatures? I haven't. I use the grill to feed me. Are you illegally luring them in? I am not. <laughs> you know how many laws you've broken just right here in your own backyard? Oh, my God. I... You're, probably luring in stupid people. That'd be my guess. I'm almost ashamed to know that you're baiting these poor creatures. Well, you're baiting them and uh, mocking them. Yeah. You're baiting them and mocking them. I'm mocking you, actually. I'm mocking you for running around in my backyard. It's not even that big a backyard. It's... Oh, come here, come here, come here. I'm you coming. Gotta you gotta see this. Uh, what, what, it's a tree. See right here? Yes, it's a tree. A tr mythical creature has been eating this leaf. You see this bite What mark? mythical creature could be have bitten that leaf? What Name a mythical creature that bit that leaf. Name Sasquatch. One. It's, it's almost like it's like mouth level to Sasquatch. He could have ate this. Aren't leaf. Sasquatches tall? Not not when they're young. 
They have to grow up just like you and me. You're just making stuff up. I mean, you're not tall, and that's like mouth level to you. They could have ate that right there. They, that's, a, that's a bite mark. That's not a bite mark. It's a, well, it's it's a probably, bite mark. It's probably some bug or something that ate a little bit on the leaf. Maybe it's do, heat do stress. Do you know anything about insects? Yeah. So now you're saying this... Clearly, folks, they exist. There's proof. Once again, I found proof. Hey, look up there. There's a Thunderbird. Get it out of here now. Ah, free from the crazy. Man, I don't I don't know what I was thinking about trying to help that guy. He is just beyond help. Hey, Big Blake Heaven! Oh my god, hey, where, hey. how'd you find me? Hi everybody. Hi everybody. I intentionally got away from you. Oh, I thought we were I thought you were ducking for cover from the Thunderbird because you they're so big. He could, he could carry you away like a little I little, literally made that up. Like a I literally made that up. There was I saw the there. shadow. Like, okay. there, there was the shadow in the sky. Schizophrenia. Luckily, make you luckily see folks, we're both okay. What do you got here? What is this? This is my letter yeah. from Kelsey Bobo. Let me see this. Offering my show. Dear Mr. Dusty. Your full name is Dusty. You don't have a last name? We'll get into that some other time. Okay. Dear Mr. Dusty. I don't want to confuse you. Though we find your show to be uh, an interesting show. Da, 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 da. Interesting. This time, it's interesting. This time we may not. What? This is a letter of rejection. No, 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 no. You're not it says right here, at this time, we're not interested in new programming. You only read the first paragraph. It's you, need a, to, you need to read between the this lines. This is a letter of rejection. It doesn't actually say we're never going to do your show. So, you're telling this me? Is the, this is the polite way of, of them saying that you are insane and we're not doing your show. Insanity is fun, my friend. <clears throat> Besides... They're still leaving me a window of opportunity. I tell you this, what. This episode is going to prove how brilliant I am. I'm going to prove what a fair person I am. Are, are those real? Oh, yeah. I'm going to give you to the count of ten to get the hell out of here before I put one in you. I haven't decided where yet. I'm going to come around to that. I thought we had this discussion about one. your budget. Two. And your special effects. Three. And your PG rating, which you just Four. You don't appear with. to be running. Five, oh, six, he, he's seven, serious. happy trails, eight, nine, ten, and watch out for those rough patches. Okay, so we gotta be a quiet, huh? Never mind. Let's, let's come on. Let's go. What? Okay. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> oh, you need to keep that on. There. I know. I couldn't help it though. <laughs> like God, you got really close to biffing. <laughs> that is part of my charm. <laughs> do you want to do it again, or how do you want to do it? Is there any way we can bring that into that? Uh, I don't know. I think I'll put that on the end for the bloopers. Okay. Yay, we're done. And the air conditioner's about to turn on. Oh no. I know. I oh. <laughs> you can barely hear in the background, but it's kind of like this really annoying buzz. Or something like that. On the video. It's kind of like a special effect. It's kind of like, yeah. It's just, Actually, if you watched my video last week, uh, I had some mild special effects that were extremely mild. It's probably on par with those special effects. It's kind of like a rainstorm. A rainstorm? It's a rainstorm. I was thinking like a wind tunnel, bit. A wind tunnel. A wind tunnel. Yeah. Like a really... Like maybe a breeze, breeze tunnel. <laughs> a breeze tunnel? Yeah, like a mild breeze tunnel. I see. <laughs> like mildly... Like yeah. it doesn't really blow you, just like it mildly poops on your face, it's annoying. If you had a cat, the cat would be like... And, I, and I'm the one that's insane? Well, not in real life. Okay. Say in real life, it's me, because I'm the one who invented all this stuff, but... Yeah, but like in the show, your character there, There's insane. a little bit of you in every one of your characters, Mark. I don't know about Leroy. Okay. Leroy's kind of... Leroy's yeah. kind of Mike's invention, straight up, Leroy's so. a special case. Yeah. <laughs> there's a little bit of Mike and Leroy. <laughs> the, there's my, might be a little more than a little bit. <laughs> Mike's a good great guy. Yeah, he actually is one of the people who watch some episode every week, so I can't say anything bad about Mike. Uh, hi, Mike. You're probably watching this right now. Hi, Mike. <laughs> All right. Thanks, Lane. Thanks for doing the episode. Thanks, Mark. All right.
if you enjoyed this program and would like more wonderful content, please subscribe to the channel. If you didn't enjoy the program, you're probably a Boris Bohemian and we wouldn't care for your business anyway. Though we'd probably take it. What? What? What, what do you mean insulting them doesn't help?